Welcome back everyone, I'm Depressed Dior, and this is Genius Sephiroth Extra, and um, we got another quest. I went ahead and did the quest to get the gold. Um, besides that, the rest of the uh, side quests were stuff to get like specific character materials, which I didn't really need. So I didn't worry about those. That and they were hard. Well, harder difficulty. Um, I went ahead and swapped out Nettery for Yomo, because freaking Yomo is awesome. Usually. She might not be in for this one, but we'll see. Okay, I think she's all set. Anyway, um, we're going to be doing the Satori quest, which means we got to go get Satori. And she's at the Palace of Earth Spirits Basement 1, apparently. Uh, something to note, though, is both Orin and Atsuo are not here, and they left behind their cucumbers. Let's see, now the question is, is how do I get downstairs? down this way. Okay, I'm just making sure there's no random encounters. For this one, I'm just going to kill everything. I'm not going to cut anything. Or try not to. We'll see. Alright, we need to head downstairs. And we should be... Yep, we're finding new stuff. Bloodhounds. Not much else to say about them. Just gonna go ahead and stick with what we know. We'll buff ourselves. Oh, I do have a new sword. I need to go ahead and mention that. I'll do that after this combat. Even though I kind of just did. Okay, well these things just hit hard, apparently. No big deal. And all of a sudden my entire party just started to randomly target everything. Fire breath. Okay, that needs to stop. <laughs> okay. At the very least, I'll try to show off all the monsters that are available. Um. As you probably can guess, Tom, the two characters are missing from their original spots. Uh, we're going to be fighting three bosses at the same time. Uh, we'll be fighting Satori and both her pets. So hopefully we'll do okay. Alright, we got ourselves a fire shard, and that's about it. Okay, let me go ahead and show off the new sword I bought, or made. Uh, Durandal has Slayer Against Giants, Birds, and Yokai. Gives you... Pretty high, like 75% resistance to Mystic, I believe. So yeah. Um, this is mainly for the boss fight, but it is stronger than the sword I had. Um, it is a, it doesn't require any special materials, it just requires the, um, what's that material called? Wow, got so much junk. It requires an Ostracon, which is that new material that's been floating around. Alright, I think you guys seen all of these. Uh, this is just Spartan Soldiers, these are just High Fairies. Unfortunately, I don't have Slayer against these types anymore because I swapped the weapon out. Oh well. Good, the last word. Hopefully, Yomu still got her um, touch. Yep, she does. And got a bomb back. Awesome. That go easy. We also got plus 90% XP, which is always good. Uh, speaking of XP, who is anyone actually equipped with a crown? Nope. Anyone? Is there anyone I should equip the crown to, really? Plus physical defense. What level are you? 84? Eh, I'm not gonna worry about it. 
how often I use these characters, um, getting to uh, level 99 is not going to really be much of an issue. Alright, so you guys have seen Redfoots and these birds. Um, these are Royal Earths. I don't remember if I showed these guys to you. I'm pretty sure I did. But they're just Royal Earths. Nothing special. Giants and birds. Nifty. I do have Slayer against that. And I want to... Get some electric here. Also Slayer against Giants, I, if I hadn't mentioned that already. Alright, I have Electricity, I have Last Word. Apparently I have Slayer against for that elemental as well. I wasn't entirely sure if I did. That sword I use has so much Slayer, it's ridiculous. Over here. Apparently not. And these are all old enemies. We need to focus on the mirror first. And then we can deal the rest of the junk. I don't have a holy spell. That's okay. Here, you can have it. Oh, I didn't know this thing's a new earthquake. Not a big deal, though. Oh yeah, I should be like paying attention for treasure boxes and all that too, shouldn't I? Also, I got a growth point. And it goes into strength. Yeah, strength. And, uh, I don't really want to fight this. <laughs> Mainly because I think that stupid cat's going to do that buff. That's really annoying. Well, if it's not going to do it this turn, it's definitely going to do it in the next one. Alright. On to business. Whoa. I have Slayer against that thing. Alright. I don't think I missed any chest, but I'll take a look real quick. And please don't have any chest hidden. I really don't want to look for them. I'm just going to take a quick look up here. I don't think I missed anything. Yep, I believe we're good. Alright. Alright, you guys again. Ah, really? Well, I'll just, um... I guess I'll have to kill you the old-fashioned way. 
Oh, are you kidding me? One of those, I know for a fact Litho has an item that makes you resistant to death. Alright. Commander Bomb. So lame. They're going up. Well, at least it's sleep. And all of a sudden, like, I'm getting hit with all the status effects, and I don't know why. Alright, well, I lost all my buffs. So might as well reapply them. Really? That's amazing. I don't even know how to react to this. I... Like I said, one of my characters has a equip with the item that gives you resistance to death. Now at least I got to use bombs of Sene for once. <laughs> really, game? Just die. Yes, I'm very annoyed. Now the fight's a little bit easier. Four instant deaths at the same time. I leveled our shard. Yeah, I have the item that pretty much gives you the most resistance to instant death. And it was it triggered twice in a row. Wonderful. Alright, what's over here? Nothing of note, apparently. Hey, chest. Or a Calcum shard. I take it back. There was something here. Oh yeah, I forgot. I can't really see how many items I have. Pretty sure... Oh. So I guess this is, this is the basement floor? I'm a little confused now. I'm pretty sure Yoma still has instant death attacks. Unless I missed something. Uh, Sakiya does not. I have I took those points away to do triple attacks instead. And might as well get the extra XP from this. All 30% of it. Alright, well I'm gonna backtrack to those other rooms because I hadn't finished clearing them. Is this basement one? I can't tell because all the names are in Japanese. Ah. Okay, yeah, I'm a little confused. This is supposedly... No, I have no clue. <laughs> I honestly don't know. There's birds over there. That's nice. No chest there. Okay, uh, Mythologian Spellcaster. I fought these a while back, but you guys never saw them. It's just a Spellcaster, really. Besides that, nothing else to say. Now a lot of hits, but not on the ones I want. Not on the monster I wanted to hit. There we go. Yeah, 
Yeah, getting shards is practically effortless now. They just drop all the time. And you guys have seen this encounter already. Oh yeah, some, supposedly one of the items I have equipped uh, gives spell reflection with uh, the Ocarina. Not sure which one. Yeah, reflect this. Oh yeah, since I, it's holy, I do zero damage to uh, constructs. No big deal. Reflect wall again. Wow, 4200. That was just a normal hit. And all the stuff we fought before. Okay. That kind of worked. I should only cancel my buff. Yep, it canceled it. There we go. I think those things always drop an Earth Shard. It's. I don't think I've ever seen them not drop one. Same thing for the other elementals, uh, higher level elementals that you guys haven't seen yet, like the un the Undyne Princess and um, Self Queens. Okay, all stuff you fought before uh, we fought before. Alright, that kind of hurt. That didn't work. <laughs> I think I'm just about out of bombs with Sene, which is like a first. How lame. Hey, gold. That's cool. Actually, I'm pretty sure I have more gold than I'll ever need, but... Come on. I th I'm pretty sure I can convert it to a... Uh, other materials if necessary. I generally prefer Yoma over Netherray for because I think Yoma does more reliable damage. Also Yoma has AoEs that are a lot better. Like this one. 
Yeah, got a bomb back. Awesome. Oh, good job, Sine. Sine actually does okay damage for a healer, I guess. Alright, this room is clear, maybe? Okay. So, what we're gonna do is head down the stair- the other set of stairs we have access to. And hope that's good enough. And I'm lost. There we go. Oh! Okay, apparently she's over here. I'm gonna go head down the stairs instead. Wait a minute. This is upstairs. Yeah, it is. Alright. I want to try to find the other chest first before we go this way, though. So, let's uh, backtrack towards the other basement, which has, apparently has more enemies. Uh, so far, we've found one chest. There's usually three to four. Um, so, we're not exactly doing fantastic here and finding things. Oh. Never mind. This was just a sealed off area. Sorry to uh, waste everyone's time. <laughs> Alright, let's uh, go back to the other room then. And, yep, off this, over this way. Okay, we're good. Just had to double check. Alright, we hopefully won't run into the boss. If we run into the boss, well... We... Actually, I, I would like to actually be able to heal myself. You know what? Better idea. New plan. We're going back this way. Come to think of it. Okay, I'm just making sure. If we're fighting old enemies, there's probably not any chest around here, so I'm just gonna leave it alone. But I'm just gonna head back real quick. Preferably this way, maybe. There we go. Here we go, chest, iron. Carbuncles, furries, mostly the same stuff we fought before. from that thing. Definitely getting uh, her last board of the proc a lot, and I don't even know why. I'm not in a formation that buffs it, and my commander certainly doesn't give, give that uh, benefit. That would be Sene. And Sene's not a commander right now. Really nasty fire breath. Pardon me. Okay. So that's just this guy. Left. Whoa, hello. Oh, yeah, this is just that stupid griffin. This thing's really easy. Oh, and I- oh yeah, I forgot I have Slayer against Avians. There we go, problem solved. Sakuya leveled- oh! And we apparently got a new skill. Uh, Elegant Killing Doll, 48 hits. Um, and it's a bomb move. Has long cooldown, though. I kind of want that, actually. Let's get rid of this move. Get that. Actually, let's take another look at it. Strength low. Eh, it should be okay. This one should be able to just auto attack, hopefully.
Come on. There we go. Let Sene clean things up, apparently. Yeah, Sene's higher tiered uh, snake weapons tend to do uh, really good physical damage. Which kind of works for her since a lot of her spells are physical based. Okay, so we still need to find... Well, those guys, I suppose. I'll just buff once. Hey, I reflected a level by. I didn't even know I could do that. Another 30%, I guess. Alright. I say after every combat. Yay, more of you guys. Oh, nice. Yeah, Sakya is just really good with Slayers. Well, quite, quite frankly, any of these characters that are physical attackers are good with Slayers. I mean, you saw how Yomu did against the final boss. Anything up here? Nope. I'm pretty certain there's going to be another chest somewhere around here. Better idea. You guys... whoop. That's better. I will take out the first thing first. Now the question is, will I do enough damage before they kill me with fire breaths? Nope. Definitely not. At the very least, heal up Sakya. What else to say about these enemies? Um, you've seen most of them already. Thankfully, this dungeon had most of them. They were missing some of the big monsters, but other than that, you guys got to see pretty much everything that I did off screen as far as random encounters are concerned. Besides, I really just didn't feel like breaking up a video. But don't worry, this won't be a normal thing. I'll probably be doing just the uh, the bosses themselves uh, soon enough. Well, not much I can do here, so block, block. I really don't like Ghost. I mean, they're not difficult, it's just really annoying because you have to put up an element every time you want to hurt one. Some of the slimes are kind of the same way, too. Wow, they're 
might not be any chest around here. Oh joy. Alright. of damage there. Generally, generally everything's around the same level. You might encounter new monsters, but they're they're not really higher level than what you've been fighting. I mean, it, it makes sense how you're already floating around the level high 70s by the time you're fighting the final boss in the original story, or maybe high 60s if you're feeling persistent. Oh, there's... Okay, yeah, I already know that route. Alright, no chest here. I'm just gonna go ahead and run right into that enemy. As much as I'd love to have more level ups, it's kind of irrelevant at this point. What I need more than levels is gear, which my levels won't really affect that. Or at least I don't think they will. Okay. Onwards. Alright, never mind. I'm going this way. I think I know where that is. Pardon me. If I remember correctly. Yep, it's here. Anime Tide Shard. Alright, I think that's everything. I think that was four chest. I'll just take a quick look around these paths here. Yeah, okay, if there's any other chest, it's gonna be in the final room, so I'll explore that area. And if it's an account, if the encounter's not a boss in that room, I'm just gonna ignore it. Yeah, I'm just gonna run away. As much as I would love to kill Yuk uh, Marissa Yukuri, um, it's not that big of a deal at this point in the game. It's only 10,000 experience. And I've already gotten the drop from the Yukuri. Alright. Presence of an ally lingers, that's nice. Okay, nothing over here. Pardon me. Over here. So I'll keep looking for that chest. I'm pretty sure there's not any others, but you never know. got caught. Sorry if you're hearing my MSN. Ah! Bird! 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 Um, this is a Sylph Princess. Uh, it's just an upgraded form of a Sylph. And this is a Harbor Frog, and this is almost worth fighting. Keyword being almost. There's a slim, slim chance that it might have a, um, item drop. I like an obsidian drop. It's, uh, it's iffy. No, I'm just gonna run. There is a quest later on to get obsidian. It's very difficult, along with uh, getting full adamantite pieces and stuff like that. 
Okay. So that's all of them. Alright, so there's no chest here. So I can just keep searching for a boss. Freely. You're not a boss. We learned in the last place that you can just pick the same monster over and over again, and you'll, you'll, you'll still have a chance of getting the boss. Speaking of, here we go. Alright, um, they're essentially all the same as they were before, just stronger. Um, Satori still has her uh, self-heal spell. Um, Satori will generally f uh, beat support, giving buffs and debuffs and status effects. Um, Atsua is probably our heavy, the uh, t main attacker, and Oren does mostly status effects. So. This is what we're going to do. The main thing is you need to kill Satori first to get rid of those heals and revives and all that annoying stuff. Uh, good news is that um, Oren and Satori are Yokai and Oku is an avian, which means um, Sakia has Slayer against all of them. So that's going to be the plan. We're going to go Commander Bomb for the sake of just doing some extra damage. Go here, buff, buff, and buff. Um, Ats Atsua does have the um, issue where if she goes below half hit points, she'll start blowing you away with Geiga Flare, so be careful about that. Time stop. Full Moon Revenge. Nine thousand damage. Around 9,000 damage again. Okay, and she's practically dead at this point. Just in case, I'm gonna go ahead and do another commander bomb just to make sure they, she dies. You go ahead and do full moon. Uh, buff everyone's resistance. You can do whatever you want. One down. Ooh. Okay, I think we're okay. As long as we don't do too much damage. Mini flare. Okay, that's not too bad. All right, Orin's practically dead, and we still got Oku to deal with. How much we got left? We got enough bombs, so go all out. Private square. Wow, Warren's still alive. Oh well. She has like no health left. Anyway, let's focus on Oku. Hey, my physical buff wore off. That's not fa that's not good. case, but I'm pretty sure we got this. Yep, Slayer plus buffs equal win. There you go, everyone. Not bad experience, either. Lethos leveled, 82. Quest completed. Aww. That hurt.
that hurt. We always get beaten up. It felt like you were controlled by hatred. Yes. It is embarrassing to admit, but it was basically that. Is it managing things like grudges your everyday work? What we manage are spirits with grudges. Isn't that the same thing? Yeesh. Anyway, since th th you're experts in these kinds of things, do you have any idea who's been spreading all this hatred around? Well, all that we know is that this hatred is as strong as the hatred in the former hell. It's a truly terrifying amount. The former hell, you say? That is certainly something that cannot be taken lightly. It seems it would be best to resolve this incident quickly. Will you all help out too? Yes, I don't mind. This is a very personal affair for all of us. Atsuo, Ren, please handle the management of the palace while I'm away. Yes, Lady Satori. Yes, Master. Hmm. I'm looking forward to working with you, Satori. And there we go. We got our blue mage back. So, good stuff. I'm not sure if I'll be using her. I haven't really been relying too much on status effects or anything like that recently. Alright. Inner Tori Feather, Anime Tight Shard. Rusty Blade. Okay. Uh, quest for Yomu. Um, quest for Eyeballs from... Squidman. All we got left is Romelia and Marissa and Alice. Um, let's do Romelia next. Yeah, I think it's going to be Romelia next. Actually, no. I'm stupid. Why am I doing that? That's what we're going to do next. Uh, but first, I am going to get the anime tight shard. Okay, so... Okay. So I can go back and take Romelia afterwards, hopefully. It looks like you have to take all the character quests before you can go on with any of the main plot, which is which makes sense, I guess. But it is a little troublesome. But enough of that. Um, sorry if you guys didn't want to see all the random encounters. I just wanted to show off the combats. Also, I just really felt like making a video. So, I am the Depressed Eeyore, and this was Genius to Sephiroth Extra. Hopefully you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you guys next time.